Well, hello, my fabulous friends. I hope you're doing well. We're going to do a little, something a little bit naughty today. We're going to be the fly on the wall and ask the uh, Vera Sabia Italiana, the Everyday Oracle, for some gossip. They're a fun card. They love to gossip. They're very chatty. Um, they're fun to play with. Uh, and they are usually bang on. So let's get into some gossip about... Harold and the Wicked Witch of the West. What's the energy around them right now? What's the energy around them? Are, what can you tell us about Harold and Megan? Harry and Megan. What's going on behind closed doors? What's going on behind closed doors with those two? Let's get into the juicy gossip. Give us some juice. Give us some juice. Some juicy gossip. Ooh, no love. The love card in reverse right off the hop. Um, oh, there's some kind of consolation prize. Somebody might be fishing for some money. Oh, Domestico. Um, let's see. Oh, 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 crying tears. Um, despondency. Uh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. They are the young man. Is so this this would be Harry. I'm not I'm not suggesting at all that there's anything like that going on. This is jealousy. Um, could be jealousy of a of a younger man. Um, it, there is mega mega tears going on. Oh my god, they've had to call in a doctor. They've had to call in a doctor, and there's no hope. This is the hope card. Um, their anchors are in the wrong place. Uh, there, there absolutely is no hope. What's the underlying? Oh, secrets, secrets, lawyers. Yes, lawyers, despondency, disgrace, um, tears and tears. You can see upright. She's just received some news. And in reverse, it's even worse. It's worse news like uncontrollable sobbing, uncontrollable sobbing. Um, uh, we've got Harry here. He is out of his mind out of his mind with jealousy, with um, distress, like the distress and everything. Um, I, I don't believe this would be would be one of the children to Mexico. This is too old for that. There's um, definitely some... Harry's jealous of somebody younger. Absolutely. But here we call in. This could be lawyers. This could be priests. This could be... This is the big guns. And we always look and see what the what they're pointing to, um, and they're point. I think they're pointing to the end of this young love affair because it's only five years old, right? So a domestico, this is a young person, or it could be even in years, and the love affair, and the lawyers are being called in to um, distribute the money. This is um, this is the cons consolation prize. So you've gone fishing, you didn't get fish, but you got, you found some money. Oh my God, the clock agrees with me. And here it's ringing five. And I said their young love affair. They've only been married five years. Um, there's no hope. There's no hope uh, for this, this marriage whatsoever. And actually they might be trying to get Harry in to see a doctor. Um, they're like, he's out of his mind. He's out of, he's almost out of control. And they're trying to get him in to see a doctor. Um, and that's their only hope. But right now, there's no hope that he will go see a doctor. If this was upright, I'd say, oh, yeah. they're And this was like this. They are. The anchor has landed and they got him the help he needs. He's a loose cannon right now, man. He's a loose cannon. Um, I, think, uh, I think the lawyers have been called in. But I think it's her who's called the lawyers in, not Harry. Not Harry. Harry Harry needs to see a doctor. He doesn't need a lawyer. He needs a doctor. Um, uh, but this, you know what I just got from this? This is not getting the invitation to the party. It It is making somebody uncontrollably upset. Um, I think that also has to do with, with Harry realizing what he's done. He definitely, I'm actually really kind of concerned now about Harry. Um, but this is their love. This is the, the end of their young marriage and there's a consolation prize and um, the lawyers are, are right now 
looking at divvying those kind of things up. But this is definitely, the first card was love and it's in reverse. The love is over. The love is over. Now it's just one great big mess. Now it's just one great big mess. And um, they're uh, both inconsolable. Both of them. They don't know, they don't know what to do, especially Harry. I mean, she knows what to do, call a lawyer and get some money. But Harry's like, Harry needs to see a doctor. Very much so. This is very disturbing to me. Um, yeah, there's no hope for this this marriage whatsoever. None, none. This it's it's done. It's over with. It's done. Um, now we're gonna watch the fallout. Now we're gonna watch the fallout. But Harry does need some medical intervention, and uh, they're having difficulties. I'm wondering if him not invited is tough love. I wonder. Uh, let's get be the fly on the wall and uh, let's check in and see uh, about their living conditions. Let's do the gossip about their living. So I've read that they aren't, they're living together for show, um, but that's all. So let's check in and see, right? So whenever, whenever you see them together, living together, whatever, it's all for show. They've rented the old... Um, Olive Garden and um, or if they're out and about it's for show only for merching purposes but I let's read about let's get the gossip on their living conditions what's going on with their living conditions what's going on with their living conditions let's get some good gossip bring out the juice cards the juicy gossip okay here we go oh geez <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a mess. It's absolutely a mess. And I don't think they're together at all. It's empty. It's empty. Oh, here we have a uh, uh, threesome. Uh, delirious. Uh, let's see what it's. Uh, ooh, a letter. Um, oh, <laughs> they're looking elsewhere. Absolutely. They, they've, they've, I would say they almost stopped looking. Oh, wow. We've got no happiness here. This is happiness and dancing and everybody. It's joyful, uh, joyful of the heart. And it's in reverse. They've received some news about where they live. Um, they might be, oh, the baby's in reverse. No children. Oh, and it's all for show. The the super, That's pride. That's all for show. Um, I, this, I'm going back here. I think this is the delirious card. This is, you know, the drunkenness, the, um, uh, I'm just thinking, I asked because where they're living, I think there's lots of parties going on. They may have been kicked out with this letter and the reversal here. What's underlying? Yeah. Messenger. You know what? I think they've been kicked out. Because they didn't look after it, they were they were partying. They it, or it's just their party place. Well, look at this empty house. Look at this empty. Look at the condition of it. Pictures, cracks, needs a paint job, and look, it's in reverse. It's empty. It's empty, and it's kind of in in a mess. And just like these three people are in a mess, and uh, I think they got a letter and got and got kicked out because of. Um, they don't live there anymore um, at all. Because look at these three are outside. They're not inside a home. And there is a house. There is a card in here called house. Um, no, so what's this third person? What's this third person? Let me keep continue to read. Yeah, they got uh, the messenger, messenger letter. They definitely got something that, that kicked them out. Because here's the house and then they have to leave. Um, I don't think they're upright is looking into the future, beautiful view. The future looks bright and sunny in reverse. There's no future here. Um, there's nothing to look at and look at the joy and the happiness that is left. There is no joy and happiness of the heart. The children are in reverse or the baby's in reverse. There's, um, I don't like that. Uh, and then the pride. The pr like they're just they're like peacocks like right you you know look at my shiny tail and they they strut around like peacocks but actually they've got nothing they got nothing and they have no future 
they got nothing and they have no future. Um, I don't see them living together at all. Actually, I see, um, look at, I've got three here and three here. I actually, I, I, they might, they might be in separate, in separate quarters or, um, they're with other people. Uh, cause there are cards here that show mother and child, mother and children and, um, the, uh, this child card in reverse. I'm not going to speak on it because I'll get a, You read into it what you want to read into it. I'm, I'm, I'm done arguing with people online. Um, you read into it what you want to read into it. Okay. Um, I, but the child card is in reverse. The Bambino, the children, it's in reverse. So I'm saying there are no children living with either one of them. That's all I'm saying on that, okay? Please don't. It's all, anyways. Um, yeah, so what you see, they're just trying to show off that they're living together, but they aren't. They aren't. Um, with this messenger here, we might hear uh, very soon that there's no future. We might hear uh, very, very soon that there's no future. Um, yeah, I think they got a they got a letter to be kicked out. I think um, one of them is living somewhere where they're having parties and fun, and one of them is living somewhere where they're crying um, and they aren't so happy. And they don't have the children, and but they're but they're um, still showing something different. So is this Harry, and is this Megan with her contracts, right? Yeah, I think that's what it is. I think somebody is has no more joy in their heart. They have no children with them, but they're still uh, presenting as if everything is just fine and dandy. And this one here, I think this is someone's contract. Um, they're just moving on with their contract. And uh, these two have no future together. They have no future. They are not together. They are not living together. But they show because of pride. Like I said in my other reading, I, they, I believe they've left Mont Montecito. I believe they're both in LA. And when we see them together... I think it's just for show. It's just for show, like how a peacock shows its feathers. But they aren't living together as man and wife. They are not. They, um, and one is without the children. And I don't know if one even has the children in the picture. I don't know. You guys make up your own mind. Um, yeah. No, there's, they aren't even looking for something new together. There's no love here. There's none. This is a, a business arrangement. Um, yeah. I think that's all it is. Because when, when I read the cards, are they living together? And I, I, I'm pretty sure it came out only for show. Only for show. Not as man and wife or a couple or anything like that. So let's ask. I've got one more juicy gossip question. Does Megan have a lover? Does Megan have a new lover? Does Megan have a new lover? Let's get the juice on that. Does Megan have a new lover? 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 Does Megan have... Hold it. I just got... You know what? That card, this one here, that is Harry's drinking. Uh, sorry. I just... That was just downloaded. Does Megan have a new lover? Does Megan have a new lover? Does Megan have a new lover? Or does Megan have a lover? That's what just came to me. Maybe it's not new. Maybe he's not new. So I better be reword that. Does Megan have a side piece lover? Does Megan have a lover outside of her legal marriage? Does Megan have a lover outside of her legal marriage? Does Megan have a lover outside of their legal marriage? Does Megan have a lover? Let's get the juicy gossip cards. Okay. Oh, La Reunion. If she did, they've split up. The Reunion, that would be, well, somebody's coming towards her. Um, the Reunion in reverse. Oh, in, in a house. See, I told you there was a house card. Oh, Morte. 
Well, if she did, it's done. Um, somebody's thinking about her, definitely. Um, I, there, I was going to say dead in bed, so I don't think any sex is going... Oh, heartbreak here. Oh, disgrace. Dis oh, my God. Ho, 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 underlying message. Yeah, you know what? Uh, he ended it. He absolutely ended it. And it, it, I think that's why they left the house. <gasps> so was, were they allowed to live in Montecito while they were lovers? And he ended it. They got a message and he ended it. He was thinking about ending it for a while. He ended it here with the death card on the, it was dead in bed. So she wasn't giving him what he wanted. So get out, out, get out of the house, heartbreak. This is, this would be the three of swords in reverse or three of swords upright because this is happiness of the heart, um, the joy, happiness of the heart. And in reverse, it's uh, a no, uh, no, you're not happy of the heart. You're actually kind of upset. And look, it has to do with the stability of the house, the stability of the house, um, in the house. I think it had... I think he left her. He's like, yeah, I'm out of here. And uh, so are you. You're out of the house. Here's the here's the notice to get out. I wonder if they were only keeping that house because she was she was dancing with the devil here. And as soon as that ended, as soon as she stopped, uh, so did them living in their house. Also. This fellow was very stable for her because the house is, is stable for its for its stability. Um, and when that stability ended with this with the death, she actually went into kind of a depression here with, um, you know, with with no energy and depression and with the despair, like total despair. She honestly didn't know what to do after that. Um, somebody here really broke her heart, really broke her heart. Um, and I think he was thinking about it for a long time and he just finally gave her the message. I wouldn't be surprised if he gave her, like did write her a letter. Maybe that's her whole big thing about letters, right? Writing letters here, writing letters there. Um, I don't know why this just dropped into me. Is this a palace? Is this when they were kicked out of the palace? The end of their royal... Is this when she was kicked out of the palace? I just got that. And when they had to leave... Is this the palace? And is this them thinking what they were going to do? And this is the message, get out. Get out. And then that's when everything ended. I think she, and didn't she say she was like, she, you know, she was in depression or whatever. Um, is this the palace? Is this the end of the palace? And did she did she um, have a lover in London? And that was the end of that when she moved to L.A. Ah, what did we stumble upon here? What did we stumble? Why is this card just move? I got to read the net. Oh, someone has not been loyal to her. Oh, yeah, look, she got the F.O. letter. Oh, I better edit that out. Oh, I think I think we stumbled upon something here. I think she I think this is her getting kicked out of the palace. The end of their royal. 
It really, really bothered her. I don't, it, I don't believe it was their choice. Now that I see this, now that I see this, I don't believe it was their choice. I think they got a letter or they got an official document or this could even be their official document saying, you know, we're leaving the royal family. Remember they made that blah, blah, word salad out of it. They made it look like they were leaving, but I think they were kicked out. And I, and I think she did have a lover there. And that and she had to end it. I, I don't see a new lover here because there is a lover card. There is, you know, um, innuendo and whatnot. She was, something was dead in bed. I think we stumbled across something. Should we ask? Let's do a quick three card spread. Um, did Megan have a, a, a lover in a London and that's why they, or is there something to do with a lover and why they were kicked out? of uh, the royal family. Is that why they were asked to leave the palace? Is that why they were asked to leave the palace? Was it because of, um, they discovered Megan had a lover and they just kind of wanted to separate them. So they kicked them out and sent them on their way, but they made it look like it was their decision. Come on, give us some gossip. Give us some juicy gossip. Ooh, thief in the night, sneaking away in the night. Oh yeah, ending widow, widower, widower, er, uh, grand consolidation prize. Um, you know what? You know what? Oh, look at that heartbreak again. This is, is this her trying to steal that jewelry? Because I my cards read that she was caught, she was caught with it, and the the palace was 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 glad that they caught it. Look at the thief. This is the thief. Look at him sneaking out with the jewelry, but he he's unsuccessful. He gets caught, and that ends things. That ends things. Okay, okay. So that would end. The love affair. I asked if that if that was the love affair, and this is the widower at uh, looking at the end of the love affair because she was caught stealing jewelry. And look at the broken heart. The three. This is the three of swords. Instead of joyful heart, a sad heart, betrayal. Hoo hoo! I think we caught something. Oh yeah, it had to do with love. It had to do with love. That person really loved her. Oh, <laughs> disgrace. Burn the house down. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And fly away, the butterfly. Fly away. In reverse, um, in reverse, this can be, uh, um, you, you, butterflies like flitter and they, and they go from flower to flower to flower to flower. And uh, in reverse, it's actually even worse. Like this is somebody who it would be considered a yacht girl or a prostitute or something like that. So I'm getting it. It, it was somebody she met while she was an escort. Oh, yeah. Disgrace. Okay, let's leave it at that. So <laughs> their, 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 their marriage is over, completely over. Um if they aren't living together, if you do see them together, it's for show only. Um, she um, did have a lover, but I think it was back in London. And the lover was discovered or something about the lover was discovered. And that's why they were kicked out. They did not leave on their own, own accord. They were kicked out. And then I asked the cards, um, about the lover, did they leave because of a lover? And it, she got caught stealing those, trying to steal, trying to sneak away in the night with the jewels. And that ended the loving relationship because we do have the Amour card on here with the widower. She did leave a lover back in London, heartbroken and with much disgrace. So um, and, and it's because if somebody that she knew how the butterfly lands flower to flower to flower, it's like how her legs spread flower to flower to flower. So this is somebody that she knew from those yachting days. 
or the Soho Escort days. That So is that Marcus Anderson? I don't think so. Um, it's definitely somebody else. Somebody else. Wow, you never know where a reading's going to go. She's totally disgraced, though. Totally disgraced. Burn the house down, like down. There's nothing, nothing left. She doesn't have the lover. She doesn't have the husband. She doesn't have the the royal title soon. All of it is going to be gone. <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to laugh at someone else's misfortune, right? That's bad karma. Um, I'm just, anyways, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up. Um, if thank you so much for your subscriptions, your likes, your comments, I appreciate and adore all of you. Thanks so much. Take good care. Bye for now. Yeah.